Finally tonight, it's been shown that pets inside hospitals can do wonders to boost the spirits of patients, but they may also be the perfect prescription for doctors and nurses as well. Here's ABC's Ron Claiborne. For these workers in Philadelphia, lunchtime is puppy time. Instead of grabbing a sandwich or a cup of coffee, they spend the time cuddling canines and caressing kittens. Where is this? At the hospital of the University of Pennsylvania. Like any other big city medical center, a place where the tension, the drama, the intensity of life and death are the norm. Healthcare is incredibly stressful, no matter what department you work in. The medical intensive care to the emergency department to the newborn nursery, it's stressful. This ER nurse, Heather Matthew, found she could only unwind when she got home to her bulldog, Annabella, and that gave her an idea. Why not help her stressed co-workers by bringing pets to them where they work? So she recruited the local SPCA to bring puppies and kittens to the hospital for the workers to play with. It's a great break in the middle of my day. <laughs> it's called the pet -a pooch program. The cats don't seem to mind. I've had people say to me, I walked in here with the worst headache and I instantly feel better. And then they go out to provide even better care to their patients. Some of the hospital workers end up adopting the pets, which is what veteran ER nurse Joyce Finnegan did. The minute I saw him, I was like, I have to get him. He's mine. That's my dog. But for most of the workers, a few minutes with a playful or sleepy pup is just the prescription. A little caring for those who care for us. Ron Claiborne, ABC News, Philadelphia.